And now we have Peter Vern, CEO of iCoat Medical. Welcome. Thank you. Hello, everyone. So let's start. What problem does your company solve? Oh, uh, iCoat works towards um, reducing the great issue of organs available uh, for transplantation. Today, there is a massive lack across the world, and every day, thousands of people die in vain. And we do this through a completely novel drug called TUM12. TUM12 protects the organ through an ex vivo treatment, and thereby we reduce something called ischemia reperfusion injury. By reducing ischemia reperfusion injury, our strong conviction is that one, organs that are transplanted will last longer, and two, organs which are often deemed marginal can be used. These are often discarded as of today, but we see strong indications that the number of uh, organs available in the donor pool will be expanded. And why should one invest in your company? First and foremost, you will help reduce the number of people dying every day. Kidney failure, which is the most common uh, form of uh, organ deficit, is horrifying. People sit in dialysis waiting for a kidney and their life and their hope just drain. Also, we are doing a phase, uh, first in human study right now. And back to back, we hope to launch an adaptive multi-center study. Uh, our ambition is to seek an IPO next fall which will fund such a study, and that one we believe can gain marketing authorization in 25 plus minus. And in parallel, the damage we work with, it's not linked to one particular organ, but rather it's an effect of how the innate immune system works. So we see a strong conviction for building a large clinical program based upon our current work. I see. And the last question is, of course, are you looking for capital right now? We have started to assess it. Our board of directors have given me the mandate to discuss with our current shareholders who always have supported us strongly. We are funded until uh, next fall in theory where we intend to seek an IPO as stated, but we see strong preclinical uh, effect of what we do and we want to accelerate, not slow down despite how the world looks today. So we are most likely going to raise capital by the end of the year or early 23. And me and my colleagues will be outside here. So if anyone wants to know more, please come and say hi. Thank you. Thank you so much.